some answers to this episode? Hopefully. Hello everybody and welcome to the galaxy. I am Fallen Star and welcome back to Maze. Now, I am thinking this is probably coming out either the day after uh, the last episode. Uh, so, this will be a longer episode just like the last one. Because, uh, you know, I want to get this done. I want to see what's going on. I want to know. I want to know. Let's do this. And boop! Oh. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Bye. <gasps> Who was that? Don't, don't scare me. Don't, don't, don't. <gasps> hey. Do Hello. Hey. Where? Okay. You must answer a riddle before you're allowed to enter. Uh... A doctor and his son are in a car accident. No, not that one. Say the one about the guy who hung himself with a nice mouth. You just gave that one away. Answer this one. What animal walks on four legs in the morning? A human. Oh, boring. I'm riddle president today. I get to pick. Oh yeah. Yes. I'm good at riddles. I knew those. <laughs> An empty bus pulls up to a stop and ten people get on. At the next stop, five people get off and twice as many people get on as at the first stop. At the third stop, twenty-five get off. So, which one of us is named Jim? Am I Jim? I thought he was Jim. No, that's Bill. Where's Bill? You're Bill. Oh, what? that's right. <laughs> you may as well enter as we sort this all out. Let's hope you're better than the last one. Um... Uh, okay, I'm scared. It was Corin talking to me. Is this is really a bad shroom trip. Oh, and watch out for our brother down there. He's a bit odd. He's a bit odd. What about you guys? You guys are okay. Okay. Yeah, well, that was unexpected. Yeah. What's up, beeping? Hi, Ted. Don't worry about it. I'll reset the elevator after a few more months of data. We overbought uh, on food pellets and have to get rid of them somehow. Bob. Bob! I told you to fix the elevator weeks ago. It takes hours for everyone to get in here because of your stupid experiment, moron. Court quarterly. Ted. I probably should have read that one first. Uh, I should probably press the button. Button! I love buttons. You pressed a button. Oh! You ate a stale pellet. Button! Oh, it doesn't let me button again. Oh! Am I gonna blow up now? Oh, button. I pressed a button, and this came out. I ate a stale pellet. Why am I eating stale pellets? Can I get out of here, please? Pellet. Oh. Pe pellet. <gasps> oh! The elevator is moving now. Okay. Oh, uh, why is it dark now? I don't like this. No. Uh. A brochure. Cool. Okay. My god, Bob, what is this? Did you actually have the gall to commission a bronze statue of yourself? It'll cost us a fortune, you narcissistic dolt. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Ted. Don't worry, I got a good deal on it. Commission these statues in bulk. Think they really spruce up the facility, especially for the tour. Could be a big moneymaker for us. Bob, you are so very stupid. What about the term classified, don't you understand? We can't host any tours, moron. Aw, don't be so mean to Bob. And don't think I didn't notice you put one near the farmhouse. Repeat, classified. Put it away, idiot. Oh, I know that statue. Wait, wait, wait. It's the same butt. <laughs> Alright. Um, hello? Uh, hello? Oh, what was that? Am I in Monsters Incorporated? What was that?
Do I want to know? Okay. Door? It's on. Uh. Hi, it's Ed. The fish shipment should be arriving today. Could be. Could you be a pal and put them in the tanks for me? Thanks. Bob, you dummy, there are thousands of water tanks here. Do you realize how much feeding these fish will cost? Ted sounds like a real party pooper. I don't know where to go. Why are these boxes so everywhere? Uh, what is this? Cheap jumpsuit. Okay. Ted, Ted, exciting news. I got us a huge deal on, a, on jumpsuits for this facility. I got thousands in bulk at a fraction of the price. I've already used the savings for some great stuff. Bob, you idiot! You got a good deal on them because they are completely useless. Nobody can wear them. Oh. Poor Bob. What is this place? What does it say? Reassure power mode active. Okay. Appears to be a report on the warfare re readiness of the subject of Project Maze. The reporter states multiple times that the sentient corn had no discernible method of raising or operating a military firearm and have a habit of taking naps right in the middle of the test. The term abject failure also appears all over the document, a running theme on many reports involving the corn. Oh, so just like the one I found in the toaster. <gasps> pizza! I want the pizza. Give me the pizza. Oh. Coat rack. Can I wax on with it? Whoops! Alright. Good to know. Good to know. Good to know. Um. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to go down this creepy corridor. Ooh, what's in here? Um, so I guess I have to place things here. Hmm. Guess I'll figure that out later. Ooh, wait, there's stuff over here. An item can be placed here. Nothing that I have. I turned on the power strip. Huh. Bob, stop playing your stupid games on my computer. It's screwing around with my AI experiments, idiot. Ted, why are you so mean to Bob? Bob. Oh, the keyboard. Okay. Bob, you disgusting slob. Don't you know how to read? Stop eating in here, Gl gluten. Glutton. Glutton. I feel like I know that word. Glutton. Bob, you jerk, put my ram back where it was. I know you took it and hit it in a stupid spot of yours. Bring it back here. Tour guide. Oh, yeah? Should I be really taking all this stuff? Up oh, there, that goes. Um, this goes over here. Okay. I have a feeling I'm not supposed to do this stuff until later. Hiya, Ted. The latest brochure came back from the press. Take a look. Think it'll be really boost the tour. And you'll be happy to know that the most sensitive bits have been re read re 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 redacted. Safety first! <laughs> Bob, first, you are an idiot. That brochure is incredibly stupid. Second, for the last time, no tours. Oh, why not? Third, if you're going to make this stupid brochure, at least add my name to it. We're co-research heads, remember? As in the same title, jerk. Oh, look at the cord and the happy child. Hi, Ted. Really sorry, but the final print has been done and sent off. I'll make double sure the next one has your name underneath mine on the front. Good God, Bob, do you have 
the reading comprehension of a five-year-old. This is a top secret facility. Where did you send those brochures, moron? Seriously, this guy is a mean son of a bitch. I don't want to meet him. He's going to yell at me. Ooh. Ooh, do you have a shark? I want to see a shark. That'd be really cool. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> nice. <laughs> hey, Ted. Notice that you took down the painting in the lobby. Thanks. It had a little blemish on it. No sweat, though. Here's another one. Be a pal and put it up, would you please? Bob, I'm not putting up another one of your paintings, you self-indulgent louse, loose, louse. For God's sake, how many did you order? And why is my face on that stupid horse? <laughs> nice. Okay. Oh, hello! What are you looking at? Jesus, scared the hell out of me. Um, there's trash like everywhere. Oop, guess that. Okay. Oh, there's another <laughs> same painting. Um, I'm guessing this is Bob's office. Bob, you disgusting slob, until you clean up after yourself, I am blocking your entrance into the bathroom. I'm tired of calling in the hazmat team every week, moron. I mean, to be honest, it is very gross in here. Oh, look, a little pack. That should be handy. Hmm. Okay, we're going this way. Let us pose another query. If a tree falls in the woods, does it make a sound? Hmm, this here is the number. What kind of tree? Sir, can it talk? Yes, but only after lunchtime. Is it wearing a look? But not many trees. This is messing. Okay. Stop, let's. Well done. This fancy ass toilet. Ooh, an etch sketch. Nice. Okay, the invoice for this incredibly extravagant bathroom calls for marble steps leading up to two extravagant toilets and a sink encrusted with gold. Cost is in the hundreds of thousands. Ted left it on Bob's toilet seat with a very pointed statement on financial culpability. I'm not paying for this. Alright then. I guess he's not paying for it. Um I'll just I'll just be heading this way. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Alright, I guess this is the last place to go. Am I gonna meet Ted now? I don't want to. He seems mean. Oh wait, this is where I came from. Okay, well, I can put stuff together, I guess. There we go. And, no, the it's just doesn't go there? Alright then. Hmm. Um. Okay. Well, now where do I go? Oh, the corn's gone. The corn is gone. Where did they go? What the heck? Okay, a memo from the U.S. government directed to a secret research directed to a secret research facility, name of which is. Redacted. Redacted. I'm sorry. <laughs> it contains an in com an incomprehensible directed directive to do something with corn. 
including an even more incre incomprehensive sum of money for the budget the year on the memo 1983. Okay. I guess this is Ted's office because it's super neat and he's got a bunch of blue sticky notes. Um, what is this? A schedule outlining the work shifts of the entire facility staff. Most notable are the shifts for the two founders. They are completely opposite of each other. All right. Where, 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 where do I do now? What do I do now? I don't know where to go. Is there more down here? Oh, there's more. I guess. Ooh. I like this room. It's colorful. Whee! Um. A teddy bear. I like it. Children's block. Don't know why I added that to my folio. It is a no nondescript children's block adorned with the letters and numbers, and you spend a long amount of time trying to figure out which is which. Eventually, you sort it out, but the number five still fools you every now and then. Why am I such an idiot in this game? I'm so confused. I love naps. Me too. I didn't when I was little, but I definitely do now. Um, is there anything in the tunnel? No? Okay. Um, alright. Guess we'll just keep heading this way. Ooh, gotta pump some iron. Except I can't lift anything. I'm just that weak. What's this? No, I got it. I can lift this one. Try as you might, you are unable to lift this more than two times in quick succession. And yet, somehow, you continue to carry it with you everywhere you go. Okay, I get it. This game doesn't like me. That's fine. Um, ooh, a swift band. Huh. Sweaty headband. Do I want to be holding this? I think not. Why is this blocked out? Ooh, so. Don't drop it. A run-of-the-mill rock with no defining features what whatsoever to discern it from the billions of other rocks currently in existence its name is Mabel <gasps> Mabel is Mabel grappling hook sorry yay so I got Chauncey and Mabel we're gonna be a happy rock family Triumphant test report. <laughs> the only way this report could sound more triumphant is if trumpets were blared every time it was read. Explains the very promising result after examining one of the new sentient corn stalks, of a breed of ruby queen corn that shows high levels of intelligence. It also glosses over the fact that the specimen is somehow female, which was apparently impossible under the gener genetic protocol the facility used to create them. Alright. Okay. Okay. Anything else? Anything else I should know before I go back to that room because I'm pretty sure that the bear goes where the thing Mobabi is. Okay. Hmm. What goes there, though? That is the question. 
Oh. Um, extremely obvious fake panel. Oh wait, can I use the uh the coat rack? What? Ah. No. What? What? But. Ah. The hell. Well, I guess we'll find out next time, because I need to end this episode here. Um, well, this was a weird episode. We, uh, met Talking Corn, we, uh, solved riddles even though they didn't even want to hear my answers. We, uh, are building uh, whatever this thing is. And, um, apparently the government is trying to use Corn as an army. I don't know how that's gonna work, but okay. But anyways, uh, I'm hoping to get even more of these out during this week. Uh, if not, I apologize, but don't worry, these, this series will be completed. Um, but thank you all for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I'll leave links in the description for this game for Wattpad, Twitter, Patreon, and Tumblr. And don't forget to click subscribe, become a shining star. And until next time, shine bright. Okay, bye. <laughs>